welcome back to the channel. Today is a huge Audi food haul. I spent £93.53 in the end. Got there in the end. We'd ran all the cupboards down, so we have got a lot of food today. So I'll run through like normal, give you all of our family meal ideas for the next week, and I hope you enjoy. So first up we've got all the random items. So I've got a packet of wipes. We still get through quite a lot of these. Some peppermint tea. They've recently changed the one they've got in Aldi. And for the maternity bag, I've got Tom some paracetamol and some deodorant for his little part of it. Then next up, I've got the Lacura Moisture Conditioner. This is like the cheaper version of the Aussie. And I've since used this, love the smell of it. Think it's absolutely great. And I'll be buying it again. And then I've also tried the Fabulosa. This is the wild rhubarb. It's a cheaper version of the method. And the Mamiya Naturals Baby Hair and Body Wash. I both love these again. They're brilliant dupes. And the Duck Foaming Bleach Gel for our downstairs toilets. Next up, we've got breakfast time. The kids are loving brioche at the moment as a quick breakfast and a treat if we're running late for school. I've got oats for me and some peanut butter for my porridge in the morning. I've got some orange juice and some soy milk. Again, this is for my porridge along with some cookie bites as a nice treat for breakfast. We've got some Wheater bisques and some milk. And that's breakfast. Now next up we have our weekly snacks. Ruby wanted a watermelon so we got a watermelon. Got raisins for the lunch box. And then we've gone for wonky blueberries, some British strawberries, some bananas and some apples. And this all goes within the first few days. Now we have lunches. For our lunches this week, I've got some yogurts for me and Tom, some salad bits, so some tomatoes and some lettuce. I've got some eggs and some tuna and some ham. This can be for like sandwich fillers, bits like that. Some marmite for rubies and some crumpets for weekends. I've also got some pickled onions because I was pregnant and a bit hormonal and fancied them. Got crackers and cheese, some butter, kids yogurts as long with kids smoothies and their cheeses for their lunches and then some cashew nuts as a nice snack. I'm loving these at the minute too. For the bits that I wouldn't have bought if Ruby hadn't come with me, we got some crispy square bars. These are actually really tasty and they went down so quick. We've got some fun sized Skittles as a treat for the kids and some Haribo, which Tom loved too. Then I've got some party rings for Lucy. We've got the cheese puffs. Ruby's picked ready salted for her and for me and Tom we got the classic variety lights crinkle cut potato crisps and then we've got some cans of coke for Tom not forgetting some more squash for the kids next up is meal idea number one we've got wrap pizzas this is such a quick and easy thing to do at home I have it with spinach and chicken and the girls have it with salami and cheese nice and simple but it's a fun thing after school to keep them occupied meal idea number two is I've got some sausages I've got some peppers and some carrots and we're going to do sausage kebab sticks Tom will most probably have this with some halloumi as well and the kids love halloumi too it's a fun dinner idea meal idea number three is homemade leek and potato soup so I've got about four or five leeks I've got some potatoes in the shed some veggie stock onions tiger bread and butter and now we have the next meal idea so the meal idea is quesillas oh that's not how you say it quesadillas <laughs> sausage bean and cheese quesadillas next meal idea is gravy meatballs so i'll just cook the meatballs off put them in the slow cooker with some gravy let them simmer all day we'll have this with some mashed potato and some veg and it makes the house smell lush as well another meal idea is burgers i like the five percent skinny fat ones with some white floured rolls we'll also add some like fake plastic cheese and some salady bits alongside it and maybe rice too for a nice easy dinner and finally for sunday we'll have a large chicken roast i thought this was quite a bargain for a chicken 
And then the leftovers we can always use as part of like a chicken noodle soup or something like that. But a lovely large chicken roast dinner is just what I fancy at this time of year. So that is everything for our family weekly food shop. Like I said, it's a big one this time because we've run down on a lot of little bits and pieces that I don't normally buy too often, like the sweet treats, stuff like that. I hope you all enjoyed and I hope to see you all soon. As you can hear, the kids are like happily playing in the background, so I'm gonna dart off and go spend time as a family. Love you lots, see you all soon.